The city of Fort Myers is out in the community with debris pickup trucks. I'm your Fox 4 community correspondent, Miyoshi Price, and I spoke to city leaders about their plans to get that hurricane debris cleared out. We want to get this uh, debris and cans all picked up as fast as possible. Councilman Liston Boucher says the city partnered with outside contractors for this project. These trucks are picking up two types of materials. One is yard debris and the other is furniture, air conditioners, metals. They must, must be separated or they won't get picked up. This is an example of what not to do. The mattress and furniture need to be in the same pile. He says the separation is mandatory because the material will go to different dump sites. Help Fort Myers. Let's get us cleaned up. As for regular trash pickup this week, there are some changes. Orange cans are for yard debris, green cans are for garbage, and they can be put out this week. The blue cans are going to delay a week. That's the recycle. Uh, so we can focus on getting the garbage and the trash picked up. The city says not to put anything in black trash bags. Because FEMA is going to reimburse us, but they won't reimburse us for any black bags. People like Stacy Krupa at the Fort Myers Atomic Art House says the cleanup process is overwhelming. You're seeing your stuff on the side of the road that people are picking through. and. And it's your good stuff. It's not your junk. It's stuff that you cared about. Krupa spent two years getting her home just how she wanted after Ian. Now Helene and Milton caused damage. The two pals are just one more task on her checklist of things to do. In Fort Myers, Miyoshi Price, Fox 4.